How's it hanging, YouTube? DJ Spaz in here. Uh, just wanted to do a little off-topic video today. Um, get some of your suggestions, some of your know-how, maybe some of your how-tos, and uh, just some overall comments. Uh, we'll get to that in a minute. As you can see, I've got the uh, the JLW315 for my home audio. I've got two JBL 12-inch uh, dual 2 ohm coil subs, a uh, Rockford Fosgate P1 in the box, got a JBL mono block sitting there, receiver. Uh, this is kind of a, just a random off topic video. Um, that's my dog. But uh, outside, once my camera focuses because of so much light rolling in, got some snow about 3 to 5 inches. Uh, it's still coming down a little bit. It's mostly just, uh, flurry now. But, uh, I didn't really want to make any more base video, or any base videos today because of what happened last time I was playing base when my car was cold. So, uh, just thought I'd, uh, not do that today. I did go out and do some drifting, though. But this video today is about saltwater aquariums. I, re I got this aquarium at We Love Pets yesterday. Um, it's a uh, it's either a freshwater or saltwater. I got the kit. I'm I'm uh, it's a saltwater tank. For me, there's a live coral in the bottom that's been rinsed and washed. Uh, there it is saltwater inside with the correct salinity. I already did the test. Um, it has the day night feature on the uh, LED. As you can see it's an LED light hood. You can see the two blue LEDs on each side. That is the day feature. And there's a three-way switch on the top. One over is off. One more to the right is a night feature which just runs the two blues which gives the uh, the aquarium a really nice blue uh, blue light. That's especially nice when it's dark. Um, this is all by Marine Land. I'll go ahead and turn the big light back on. As you can see there, Marine Land. Uh, the kit included the um, heater here and the Marine Land filter, which is the it's made by Penguin with the uh, the bio wheel. This is the smallest. Uh, filter that they make with the bio wheel as you can see it's spinning there nicely got the intake hose there and the uh, carbon filter there put that back together this is my first saltwater tank and if you're curious as to why I know so much so far I will show you momentarily as you can see there there's the heater um, it is a 10 gallon tank temperature is resting at 80 right now, so I need to turn the, f the uh, heater down just a tad because I want it to be around 76 to 78. It's got the uh, the liftable hood and everything, and it uh, it's a very nice tank. It needs to uh, I need to clean off a little of the gunk inside, but uh, that's mine. I'm waiting for the uh, I need to do chemical tests on it to verify the ammonia the pH and the nitrites and nitrites nitrate and nitrite I need to do the test on those so I will go show you why I know so much about salt water right now my mom is sleeping right now
but that was my father's tank. Uh, he got it for Christmas, which wasn't that long ago, and he has the uh, the clown you saw, and the uh, the one fish there. There's another fish that I couldn't get because I didn't want you guys to have to listen to my mom snoring forever. But uh, I'm thinking about waking her up with some MW3 or something. But uh, this is just a video that uh, is welcoming comments, suggestions, how tos, tips, pointers, hints, anything you guys can give me about saltwater. Uh, what you recommend, um, just all of the above. Um, it's empty right now. I'm just like I said. I'm waiting to do the uh, the chemical test. It takes about three to three days to maybe a week or so for the uh, the chemicals to get right and get the bacteria flowing. Um, it took the big tank in there about a week, but since this one's smaller, I'm banking on it not taking so long, and I can go ahead and put something in it. Um, so that's that video. I just wanted to show you guys a new little toy uh, and what I will be uh, doing with it. Um, I'd like to get definitely. I'm gonna get a rock, or I'm gonna get at least a one small rock, maybe one main rock that's a little bit bigger, and uh, I'd like to get an anemone, an a clown, a crab, uh, a horseshoe crab, uh, and just some smaller things that can thrive in a, uh, a small to medium tank. So uh, there you go, that's it. DJ Spaz in here signing out. Um, just remember what I said. Uh, subscribe, comment, hints, tips, how-tos, pointers, suggestions, all of the above. Thanks for watching.